Hey, hey, everybody. Happy Friday. I know it's been quite a while since I've done one of these. Uh, life's been pretty hectic uh, the last couple of months, so trying to squeeze these in has been kind of tough. Lately, it's just been a lot of me eating uh, gas station foods, like quick, stupid, cheap meals that aren't very good that everybody's had a thousand times. So it really hasn't been much point to doing these. But today, I think I may have found something. I am looking at the right spot, right? I hate when I put my phone this way. Right there. No, right there. Ah! Anyway, all right, so uh, today I'll be eating the classic Chuck Wagon. Um, I think Chuck Wagon's a brand, right? This one happens to be ham, salami, bologna, American cheese, and a poppy seed bun. Did I eat one of these like a couple months ago and record it? I don't remember. We'll just take a bite today. But actually, the thing that made me want to uh, to try something new, and I, I have a hard time believing this is new because it doesn't say new flavor on here or anything. And usually when that happens, it's, I mean, whatever. Have I just completely missed out on these uh, Lay's cheddar jalapeno chips i feel like these are right up my alley like these are the kind of things i like cheetos jalapeno are the best cheetos that they make so i would assume these are going to be pretty good too um purchased these from speedway or super america no it's speedway now it used to be called super america but just in minnesota um i recently saw one of those maps that had like the number one gas station by number of locations per state um for minnesota it is speedway or Super America. Um, the only other state where that was the case was Indiana, because I think it might be an Indiana-based company. I'm not sure. Um, but everywhere else, it was different gas stations. Anyway, this thing looks absolutely disgusting and not healthy at all, so let's try it. Mm-hmm. Here's what I'll say. And by the way, I've only got about three minutes to do this because I need to get on to the next project. It tastes like you took Oscar Mayer lunch meat, slapped it together on a crappy bun, and there you go. Let's try these. All right, it smells kind of funky, but that's okay. A lot of cheese things do. Here's the chip. Mm. Oh. Says that it's spicy right here. Um, it's got a little tiny, itty bitty bit of a kick. A little bit of a throat burn in there. Pretty typical for like your jalapeno seasoning when it comes to chips and whatnot. These are decent. They're not great. I mean, it kind of tastes like, like the Ruffles cheddar and sour cream. With a little kick. That's what I would compare these to. So if you like those and you like a little bit of spice, you're probably going to enjoy these. Again, Clearly, these have been out for a while because it doesn't say new anywhere on here. So, as far as the Chuck Wagon monstrosity that I just took a bite out of, it's a three. Uh, as far as these chips go, not terribly exciting. I'd say, I don't know, six and a half, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I do have one fun one that I want to do pretty soon that somebody sent to me. So, I'm really hoping to get that one done here in the next couple weeks. So... Also, there's another spicy one I want to try with somebody. Some spicy Thai food in the area that I, um, I was told I need to try, so I might try that as well. So anyway, all right. Hope everybody has a fantastic weekend. Peace.